Man, that's what's up with here. Yeah, so that's uh, that's a little something uh, that uh, that I did a while back. Ring of Fire. I was going through all my uh, tapes and mixes and stuff like that and recordings, old recordings. I found that, so I was, I was uh, thinking about that one right now, especially that it came up. That was, that was kind of a trip because. That right there is not, uh, that's the one and only song, you know, uh, I'm old school, I'm one of those things that uh, MCs, if you don't write your own stuff, then like, you're not an MC, so, <laughs> sorry, but uh, yeah, um, that's one that my brother wrote, you know, and he's uh, Pastor John David, so if uh, you know him, if you don't know him from back in the day, his name was Moody, you know, and um, man, dude wrote some good lyrics, you know. Like, the lyrics that he wrote in this were real, real good. He had it in a poem, and he wanted me to put it out for him and do something, and I was like, yeah, I'll do it. So, you know, Pastor John David, if you didn't know, he can get down to rap. This is his lyrics. Now he's uh he's real good and I wanted to uh, uh also say a shout out today man today I, I believe I, I too have been you know it's been real hard with all this stuff going on but I know uh, he, he's on the other side of town uh, from us and I know that uh, recently he lost a real real good friend of his um, I've, I've known him too he's a real good real good guy and uh, you know he was there today I believe was the services. So I wanted to, uh, uh, you know, a shout out. You know, everybody's going through stuff. You know, everybody's dealing with stuff right now. And, and no matter what, that that ring of fire that you're stepping into, you know, um, God's going to see you through. No matter what, God's going to see you through. And it doesn't matter what we have to deal with. It doesn't matter what's going on. You know, I want to encourage everybody, hey, forget about this fighting and stuff like that over the, you know, the pastors doing stuff. Man, you got to, uh, I, I feel for my brother, you know, as a pastor, my mom's a pastor too. I got a, a, a grandfather who is a, a retired pastor, you know, so I know how pastors go through and it's, it is very uh, difficult to make any decisions right now because everybody's trying to, to step and see what you're doing. You know, what are you going to do? You're going to open up, you're going to close, you're going to do what? Man, come on, man. Let's, let's think about how we can work this together. You know, let's, you know, how can we, how can we figure out the rules uh, and follow the rules be safe for everybody and just be smart. You know what I mean? This is not something that we gotta, you know, stand up and, and and make a hardcore stand for right now. Let's let's do this and be smart. Why don't we? Hey, finally, hey, all those times that that, that we're out there, uh, 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 our brothers, uh, uh, Pastor Brian Ayala, right out there on the streets ministering and stuff like that. We got a lot of brothers out there doing that. Well, hey, let's do this at the church in the parking lot and do the food pantry thing at the same time, <laughs> right? While they're coming up and picking up the food, they park. We fill up the trucks while we're preaching outside. Everybody stays in their car, you know? Let's work with the authorities. Let's figure out a way, right? Why can't we all be happy? <laughs> you know, that's what needs to get done. We need to be encouraging. We need to be positive. We need to start looking for ways to do things, you know, that's going to that's gonna work with the uh, the authorities and work with God. That's what God, that's what Jesus would want. That, that's some good stuff right there. So let's figure out a way. Let's let's get it happening. But yeah, I want to see, hey, for, for, you know, we got a lot of churches that are opening up. They're uh, they're gonna they're gonna uh, have service tomorrow. That's fantastic. Let's let's do that because there are people that they don't have internet. They can't get online. They they you know they're restricted. So if they can get out to the church service, that's great. And then there's a bunch of church services that are going online. Uh, Pastor uh, Alex um, um, Lara at uh, Elevate Ministries. He is going to be doing his service all online tomorrow. Uh, Elevate Ministries SA .com. So if you're at home, you're stuck at home, you have no place to go and do your do your service. His is going to be right off the website. You can watch him live from there or from Facebook. However, you know, he's set up with his website to be able to do whatever he needs to do with the ministry, whether it's online or in person. You know, if it goes down to that where they, hey, they lock us down, they bring out the army trucks and stuff like that, and we get locked down, whatever, we're cool. We, we could still sit here, sitting in, in our uh, my make-believe office here. Look, this is a, the little sheet back here in the back. <laughs> you know, we can still sit there and, and make the services good and make it where we can worship. We can sit here praising God, worshiping God right here online together in unity. And I, I love what my brothers are doing. All my brothers out there, uh, 
Uh, I see a bunch of people on here. Um, Eric Salinas, uh, Abraham, Corona, uh, Joseph. Uh, Joseph, hey, how'd the kids do? Did they win? <laughs> Did they win? Uh, my brother Joseph just has, uh, he sponsors a little league team and they, they were out there. So cool, that's cool. Uh, so, you know, that, that, that's what we want to do is, is make sure that, that we are out there where everybody's going to be. So if it gets to the point where we get locked down and stuff like that, man, online is going to be the best way to go. So having both things, having two things, having the being able to work with the authorities and, and, and be flexible, you know, it's not something we have to take a stand on like they're trying to take away our rights. You know, praise God. They're saying, hey, it's not even in, in Texas. We're lucky. We're blessed. It's it's a, a um, it's not a law. You know, there's a, there's they're asking us not to congregate. But, you know, it's not against the rules if you do. So we're straight. You know, you don't have to worry about it. But that's all it needs to be is just, you know, hey, let's be cool. Let's handle this. Let's make sure we get the, the, the disease out of here. You know, I was talking to my wife and I was telling her it's, it's kind of like that. It's like, hey, uh, no problem, man. When they come and they say, hey, you need to get the little stamp or whatever on your forehead or you need to come and, and we're going to cut your head off if you, if you don't stop believing in Jesus Christ. Man, sign me up. I'm straight up. I'm going to be the first one lined up. Cut the head. Cut the head. What's up, Emery? How you doing? <laughs> Emery's one of my brothers. He's down, right? We're down for Christ. We're going to roll up. Man, all the brothers I got on the line with me right now. We're going to roll up. We're going to stand there. We're going to we're gonna let you take me down for Christ. I don't care if that's what it takes. If that's what it comes down to. We're, we are going to fight and stand for Christ no matter what. No matter what. Right? But that's not what's going on here. They're not saying, hey, you can't have Christ. They're saying, hey, help us out with the sickness. Can you, can you do something? <laughs> you know? And that's all they're saying. So for those of you that are gathering, great. Do the, the distance thing. Make sure the seats are spread apart. You know, a hand sanitizer, all that. For those of you who aren't, aren't gathering, you're online. Fantastic. That's perfect. That's what we need. You know? Because now we're going to reach more people because there's so many people that are going to be online tomorrow. They're going to be up. They're going to be on their phones. They're going to be there. So let's flood Facebook. Let's flood the internet. Let's flood everything out there with everything you need so that the churches can be connected with their people. So that's what I'm going to be doing uh, tomorrow. I'm running a class. Um, you know, it's a training class. And if you don't have a website, I'm talking to people who don't have a website or you do have a website, but you don't know how to use it. Uh, especially WordPress. If you have any kind of WordPress website right now and you don't know how to really use it and rock it out, uh, I'm the one that did the uh, website for uh, Elevate Ministries and tomorrow they're going to be taking their whole church online. It's going to be incredible. And we are wanting to make sure that everybody, anybody that wants to do this, Christian businesses, uh, churches, um, you know, anybody that's affected by this and hey, I, I'm running something and and I can't do it from the from the business. You know, I got to do it from the from the garage now. Well, no problem. I'll show you how to do it just like this, just like I'm doing it. So I'll show you how to do that. I'll set up your website. We're gonna have a, an online meeting. I'm gonna be uh, uh, posting a link to it here. We are calling it uh, social distance proof. So if you want a social distance proof website where you cannot, um, uh, you know, you can't be locked in a room and still not handle business you still can't minister to people you still can't get out there and spread god's word no matter where you are no matter how far i mean think about it we could be spreading this worldwide worldwide you know when we're out there at the at the in the buildings and in the streets and in our city we are just in one location but when we're online we are worldwide so that's what we want to make sure that in this time where it is a thing that now we have to social distance ourselves. I want to show people everywhere, anywhere that wants to learn, let's get you guys going so that you can get out there and share the message that God put in your heart worldwide. Emery, you also need to get, uh, uh, let's do one, let's do one. You're, you're in anyway on the church. I need you for Lighthouse. So for Lighthouse, uh, uh, you're in. We already got a ticket uh, for you. Uh, it, it is by tickets. Um, what basically, when you come to this uh, class tomorrow, I'm going to show you how I build WordPress websites from start to finish. It's what I would do for a, a business or a church. I would charge $600 for a website like this. And I'm going to uh, uh, have this class tomorrow from 7 p.m. to 9 p.m. You are going to have a finished website by the time you're done. So it's a two-hour class. It's high speed. Uh, what I'm going to do is right at, at the first two hours, I'm going to show everything and all that. Second, uh, uh, after that's done, I'm going to go ahead and stay online for questions and answers. It's a Zoom meeting, so you can get on uh, You can get on it through your computer. You can get on it through your phone or tablet, however. But we're going to be teaching this class. And again, I put the link here at, in the thing. Um, so go, go check it out. Um, it's a $100 class, but it is going to be so worth it. It's going to be 
definitely getting you set up and connected to where you're going to be able to have your stuff. So it's got all the information on the class and everything like that, but we want to make sure that you know what you're doing so that you can get out there and spread the message. That, that man, more than anything, that's in my heart. That's why I want to do this because I want to, man, for a long time, uh, God has put it in my heart what to do to make sure these things run and function. And there's all kinds of cool plugins and functionalities and, and different things that we could do for the website that will actually turn it into a live being where it's actually helping to promote. And so when you go and post something on a website, it goes out to Facebook and Instagram and all these places and it promotes stuff for you. So instead of sending traffic back to Facebook or sending traffic back to Instagram, what it's doing is taking Instagram traffic and Facebook traffic and bringing it back to your website. That's what you want. When you do the work of building a website and putting your, your, your church out there, your business out there, whatever, when you do that work of doing that, you don't want to then send traffic from your site to their site. You want to send traffic back to the other way. Sophia, yes, please. Uh, again, that link that I just posted, uh, uh, click on that link and, and go to it. Um, but yes, like I said, we'll get it all hooked up where I'm going to teach you so that you know how to run this. So it's not just that I'm going to show you how to do a site. It's not just that you're going to have a site when it's done. But it's going to be where you know how to rock it out uh, just the same way as I do. I, I talked to a couple of my web designer friends and they're like, hey, why are you, t you know, now we're going to have a bunch of people that know how to do web design. Well, great, fantastic, you know. I, I, I don't care. I want the word to get spread, you know. So that's what I'm talking about. So I want to make sure that we get people connected with what they need so they can spread God's word as far as possible. So, yes, Sophia, get, get on there. Uh, get in the class. There's 50 uh, seats because uh, I don't want it to be too too much, but we're going to be doing it on Zoom. I want uh, enough people to be able to ask me. So I want to do this uh, tomorrow because, hey, for sure for the next week, next two weeks, you know, we need to be online already and ready to go. So like I said, in two hours, you'll be online, you'll be ready, you'll be ready to go. And we're talking in a whole new way that you've never thought about before. I can do some really cool things with websites that you've never seen before. But uh, just on the basic parts, you know, that the websites are going to be... Uh, um, uh, of course, mobile ready, you know, so people could look at it from their iPhones, from their uh, cell phones, from Androids, tablets, I, uh, iTunes, Apples, whatever, you know, anything you, um, anything you're, you're on, it'll be on. I'm going to post a link right now. This is uh, Pastor Alex Lara from uh, Elevate Ministries. That's his website uh, that we did for him, and we're doing the same thing, and he'll be sending one of his people to the class tomorrow so that they could learn. Because like I said, it's not just about getting your website up. If you already have a website, great. I'm going to take it and make it powerful and make it so that it could do a lot more than you ever thought it could through plugins and all kinds of stuff. It's all, all what I'm talking about is WordPress. So if you never mess with WordPress, and uh, you need to, okay? So I'll tell you this. WordPress is the minimal equivalent. Uh, it would be the lowest common denominator if you're trying to do things straight up hand coding. So the best actual website that you want, you know, top of the line is going to be, you know, straight up hand coded, you know, original JavaScript, CSS code, all, all that stuff. It's all original, right? PHP, it's all yours, right? That's, that's the best. That's thousands of thousands of dollars. No business can pay for that, right? So the best option to do something like that would be WordPress, which is a, um, it's a, what's called a content management system. And what it does is that it gets, um, puts it to where everything is in one easy to use interface. Now, it is difficult if you're not used to it. So it can look scary and look intimidating. So I know there's a bunch of people out there that are like, man, I have a WordPress website or I've had WordPress before and I don't like it, I hate it, whatever. Well, I'm going to make you fall in love with it. I'm going to show you how to use it so that you're like, wow, I didn't know it could do all this. Okay. The other thing is, um, these uh, uh, site creators, if you're on something like Wix or whatever, the uh, websites are things that you should be able to pay once for and that's it. Not that you have to pay every month. So what you're doing is because you're not paying for the design up front, you're paying every single month for the service. So in other words, if you're doing it where you're doing a, um, like a, a, a $30 service or whatever, right? Eventually, you're going to pay more than whatever you paid for your website because you're going to have to keep paying for it. Same thing with Squarespace. Uh, are you, uh, uh, Jim's asking a question here. Are you, are you using uh, Squarespace free? Or are you using a paid version of it? Let's find out here. So if it's the free thing, okay, that's great. You don't have to pay for it. However, 
that's again moving traffic back to them because that means you have a something you know like like for me it would be capone.squarespace.com or something like that right you're going to have some weird domain name that's not really yours and even if you can mask it you're still technically on their server so no matter what you're going to be on their server so the best thing to do in that case would again be to uh not to, oh yeah okay so yeah if you had signed up you're either going to do that and be on that free server thing or you're going to um, you're going to pay the service, which you're still on the server, but now um, uh, you're able to uh, do all the uh, the extra things or whatever like that, all the shopping carts, all that stuff, right? So the thing is, you're paying like thirty dollars, twenty five, whatever the price is, right? You're paying that every month for as long as you want your website up. So if you plan to just try something out, test it out, let me see how it works. That that's fine. That's great. Uh, if you're planning on having longevity, you want your website up for 10, 20, 30 years, right? You don't want to pay that for the rest of your life forever. And if you stop paying, that's it. All of your stuff is gone. So it's not like you have a file that you could download and take somewhere else. So like with us, if we build you a WordPress site, you can take that down off our servers and go take it to another server and upload it over there. You can do that because you actually have a website. With the other with services like Square, Weebly, Wix, a any of those uh, uh, overnight website builders, you know, and then the other thing is, with those things, is, uh, you know, this is a big pet peeve for me. It's the same thing, like, uh, like that's why I don't, I'm, I'm not a car guy. I don't work on my car. I don't do the engines and stuff like that because I'll mess it all up, right? I got a guy, he does it, right? And so, yeah, technically, when it comes to it, you're not a web designer, you know? So why are you going to sit there and design? you don't have the eye for it? You don't know what to look for. And, and it's not your fault. You're just, that's not what you do, right? So... They're telling you that you can make it overnight, and they try and put as much uh, intuitive stuff into it, but still, a lot of people's uh, sites come out pretty ugly. <laughs> so we're going to hook it up to where it's amazing, it's awesome, it's got video, it's got this, it's got that, you go live on it. Like We're going to hook it up to where it does so much for you, but it's going to be on your own server, it's going to be your own site, all the traffic that you bring is yours, you keep it, you keep this, uh, everything is yours. That's how it should be. And the best thing is, I'm going to teach you how to do it. So again, think about it. If you're with this, uh, this class that I'm going to do, it's $100 for the class. Uh, your website would be, if you did it on Wix or whatever, you know, say 25 bucks a month, you know, after four months, you're going to pay more than you would have paid the 100 bucks. So that right there should tell you about that, right? So when it comes to those builder things, I would stay away from them. Like I said, you can't even do a free WordPress thing, but if you do the free WordPress thing, that you uh, like if you go to wordpress.com and you get a free WordPress website um, you will eventually have to pay the premium one to get the plugins so I'm gonna show you all the tricks around that I'm gonna show you what the pros do I'm gonna show you what I would do straight up to get somebody up uh, in two hours to get the website up finished ready and ready to start uh, pushing out there in two hours so that's what the class is gonna be it's gonna be tomorrow night 7 to 9 p.m. If anybody uh, uh, wants to be a part of it, please let me know. If a church wants to be a part of it, I'll give some group discounts and stuff like that. Send as many people as you want. We'll, we'll hook it up. Just For me, it's more important that ministries are getting what they need so that they can get out there and spread the word. I want to make sure that your website isn't just a website. Again, the websites that I'm going to be doing, aren't, they're not going to be web, just websites. I'm going to show you how to set it up to where it does stuff for you so that it's automatically working on your behalf to promote it to get it out there that whatever the word is that you're putting if it's a business if it's a church whatever it is it's going to get the get your stuff out there so join me online the link is is right here again let me put it uh one more time but uh you can get your tickets right here at this so uh, uh our website and it's going to be tomorrow and uh another thing uh we're going to record the, the meeting tomorrow so it is one of those, I'm going to help you do it along, uh, along with me. Uh, you're going to follow along while I'm doing it. You're going to have screenshots and everything. You're going to watch every step. You're going to be able to ask me questions. You're going to be able to understand the full knowledge of it. And so that you don't, in case it is going by real fast, I'm going to record everything and we're going to package it and you're going to have access to all the recordings. So that way you're not going to miss nothing either. So definitely, uh, you know, check it out. Uh, uh, Jim, I'd like to see you tomorrow there at the thing. Anybody else wants to be in there? We want to see you. Alex. Uh, uh, there's a bunch of people in here. Sorry if I miss somebody. The thing doesn't move fast. <laughs> uh, but yeah, we're going to be coming on more. We're going to be doing more messages, lots of tips and tricks. Uh, there's going to be lots of uh, 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 things out there today. I was just, you know, in, in all this, the, the, I'm getting lots of calls and people are asking me, what, what can I do on this and that, right? 
Uh, one of the things we had to figure out for the site real quick was how to get um, uh, the uh, live feed onto the website for tomorrow for uh, Elevate. So a question came up that no one's ever used the new Facebook creator uh, from Elevate. So yeah, that's a good one. You know, we need to tell people, hey, there's a, there's a new thing called Facebook uh, uh, Creator Studio. So go into Google, type in Google, because it's hard to find it on Facebook, it's not automatic. Usually if you have a page, uh, if you have a, a, a business page or an artist page or something like that, and you go to your page and you try and publish something, like anything that you try and publish, it'll pop up a little thing that says uh, publishing tools. If you click on that, that'll give you the option, to, it'll usually say try the new Facebook Creator Studio. That thing has a bunch of amazing tools and in there, if you want to do uh, where you put your videos on your website, you go in there, you schedule a video, then you grab the embed code and go and put it on your website. And now when you go live on your video, it's on your website as well. So when you take that on the websites I build you, when you take that embed code and you go and put it on your website, then the website is automatically going to share that page to the world. It's going to say tomorrow at this time, this video is going to be live. Come check us out. And it's going to do that work. So all you do is post it in the page, post it on the website, and that's it. You're ready to go. So... You know, it's it, like I said, it, it's going to be where it saves you a lot of time. If you're tired of having to post on Facebook and Instagram and all these different places, the website will save you time by posting all these different places for you. That's that's just one plug-in functionality, one feature. Uh, another huge one is going to be um, uh, SEO. So there's a plug-in that we got that's going to give you monster SEO where you're just going to get, uh, like, it'll tell you every single page, your site is ready for uh, uh, putting it out there. It'll give you a bunch of um, uh, keywords and, and all that stuff. So it, it's gonna help you get the search rankings really quickly. And once I show you how to post the pages right to your page, then you'll definitely be able to get your stuff out there in a big way. So, you know, that's, that's our plan. That's what we're doing. Uh, we hope to see you guys. Click on the link. I'll be going live again tomorrow during the day and stuff like that before the event. But uh, yes, it's gonna be tomorrow. Uh, make sure you get uh, check out Zoom meetings. Uh, that's another thing that, that the churches could be using to uh, have Bible studies. Uh, that's a great way to bring in. You can bring in, I believe, up to 100 people uh, with the free version. So with the free version of Zoom meetings, you can host your Bible studies and be able to um, um, have other people ask questions and everything like that. It could be a real uh, interactive uh, a meeting. So before the class tomorrow, if you're going to be in the class, then go and check out Zoom meetings, download the app if you're going to do it on your phone, or, or you can just watch it on the web when you get it. So it'll be really cool. You're going to be excited. I'm going to be excited. We're going to put out a good thing. Two hours. Two hours, and you're going to have a full website ready to go, ready to blast out. We're going to do it. Dad, I see you. My dad's watching from California, um, so that's cool. Uh, but, yeah, Dad, you got your tickets. All of my clients, anybody that's a client already that they've already done the website with me, you already got your ticket. You that it's included with the website, so uh, definitely uh, come check it out. But anybody that wants a full website, they, they've been waiting. They have a web guy that it, I'm still waiting on it. We're gonna get it done. We're gonna knock it out two hours tomorrow night, 7 p.m. to 9 p.m. I'm gonna show you step by step. We're gonna walk through it. We're gonna learn. You are going to be experts. It doesn't matter your level. It doesn't matter. I'm gonna actually uh, just to prove that. I'm going to have my kids online learning how to do websites the way dad does that night as well. So it doesn't matter what level you're on. I've got kids uh, uh, that are uh, preteen and teens, and they're going to be on online learning how to do websites just like you. So it doesn't matter if you're not good with computers. It doesn't matter if, if you know uh, you hate electronics. <laughs> I'm still going to show you how to get it done, and it's going to be so easy. You're going to be like, man, I should have been doing this a long time ago. So. We'll see you guys tomorrow. Uh, have a nice night tonight, guys. Be blessed.